Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel and today a little bit different subject I want to show you my update here in my studio So I was having some trouble with lightning uh, regarding my videos now that I decided to make some not more, not all of them but some videos at 4k so um, I bought this the Godox P120L softbox as well as this lamp here behind which is Godox SL100 100 meaning 100 watts and it's by because it has a few different controls here and uh, you can you can do some special effects you can do control by Bluetooth and stuff like that and I was just not expecting it would be so fucking big I mean it's crazy now this is my my camera my normal camera normal I mean it's new it's a 250d EOS with a wide lens and the new microphone as well as well as a timer code so I can see myself when I'm filming if it's uh, everything okay now check out the size of this I don't know if this will make any justice there's no light yet but you guys will see just in a minute it's super super big I mean if it's the old room basically so I'm gonna turn it on and uh, check it out and there we have it has a fan and if you guys can hear it then you can regulate for a more of a bright light or a warm light warmer light and some special effects as well uh, but this is big man this is really huge and uh, I was not expecting this I don't know if everything is now much better in my GoPro or not I'm gonna point toward the light uh, just for fun it's crazy man now I'm going to connect my camera and make a small video so I can see and show you guys how the light is much better right now for making my YouTube videos so let's check out that right now so here I am now I think it's much better it's oh shit the phone this is where I record my voice by the way uh, right now it's focusing on my face but I think everything is clear and you can see that uh, the studio you can see most of the studio using this light now of course there are ways to put it better like sideways and stuff like that for better detail uh, there are ways to fine-tune the camera right now it's in uh, auto focus so it is what it is but I can put it in manual focus I just have to study a little bit better everything here in my studio but with this angle I can basically pick up a guitar and um, it gets everything in the background not only the guitar but I don't have the problem to see if it's capturing or not and I may use another camera I'm sorry to capture here a little bit closer I'm not gonna make them all 4k because uh, it is very time-consuming and although my computer is very fast um, uh, it's not I mean it's fast but Final Cut can be very very heavy uh, editing or any computer editing 4k uh, especially if you have uh, one or two two or more I mean uh, files uh, so that's what it is but I think it looks cool you can clearly see the guitar yeah and all the details if you want to show something close up or something like that probably it will work too let me just grab my phone now it's on the guitar I guess it's in focus there's always a little bit of background noise regarding the image but um, you know that's the way it is so um, yeah this is my new setup so I hope you guys enjoy enjoy this small video and uh, I'll see you soon with new patches by the way I just launched a new mark 5 I'm always looking at the camera at the screen and I should be looking at you I just launched a new uh, pack for the G2, GT1000 and Core 
um, the Mark V based on the Mesa Boogie Mark V Channel 1, no, Channel 2, Channel 3, a solo, and then a uh, clean. Yeah, uh, check it out. I'm gonna put some links here so you guys can see at the end of the video. So that's it, guys. Hope you guys are safe. Always looking at that. I must look at you. And um, many thanks for your support. And see you on the next one. I'm gonna disengage the camera now. Bye.